What's up, nerds? We are here at Toylanta, so let's take our stuff up to our room, meet up with everybody, and let's see what's going on. First thing we're gonna look at, we're gonna come down here. Look at this booth, man. The first one we go to is just freaking awesome. What is this? Mega Supreme. Let's see. Ooh, we got some Thundercats over here. I'm always down for Thundercats. I am Williamo, Lord of the Thundercats, and you're watching Bite Size Geek. Thundercats! Oh! What is that? Oh, that's Splinter. I already have him. VR Troopers? When is the last time y'all saw VR Troopers? Let's see. What's down here in the Marvel Legends? Oh, I've been standing a long time. It kind of hurts to bend my knees. Does that mean I'm getting old? I don't know. Logan and Hawkeye. Oh, the white vision. All right, so right here we got Turtles in Time. We got, what is that, Raphael? Raphael, Michelangelo, and Michelangelo. Those are pretty cool. And we got some Super 7 up here. What do we got? What do we got? Uh, Casey Jones. Donatello, uh, who do we got right here? Pumra. I'm sorry for the angle, y'all. I'm really short. Ooh, Leatherhead. Jackal Man. I have a funny clip of me playing with my uh, retro Jackal Man when I was a kid. If I remember, I'll throw it in the video right here. Those are Power Rangers, another Leatherhead. Oh, they got some good stuff over here. Come in like one of the big rooms. Like what, what are they waiting on? Are they in line? Got JP's toy trunk right here, Diamond Dave. Everyone's filming everyone. <laughs> oh, turtles. Always down for some turtles. All retro, tin bag. Nice. Oh, the pizza cutter. I've been looking for that actually. Oh, been looking for these too. Might have to come back. I can just look around first before I start buying anything. Wow. <clears throat> Man, there's so much cool stuff in here. So like right here, like look y'all, I got excited because I thought this was the Grimlock that I've been looking for, but it's not. We've got Astro Train. Two Astro Trains. Let's see over here, we got... Oh, here's Rogue. How much is Rogue? I don't see a price on her. <clears throat> Let's see. Oh, there's Brown Suit Wolverine. There's no price on Rogue. Gonna have to see if I can get a price on her. It's Thanos. <clears throat> Iron Man. So far, there's a really good Marvel Legends selection here at Toylanta. What is that? Rodimus? What? Unicronus? Never heard of that. Never seen it either. Got that Thor. I like those Thundercats up there. 
Let's see. Spider Man. Oh, Angela. Didn't she start out as a spawn character? Nightcrawler. I like that sinister. 20th, what is that? 20th anniversary Optimus Prime. So, first thing I picked up is this TMNT print from Retro Toy Quest. Been looking for this one. I never see it in like his online shop. And I uh, asked him, would he have them here? And he said, yep. And I love it. He has a whole bunch more, a bunch of different toy collections if y'all want to go check him out. Yeah, totally worth it. But yeah, check out how busy it is in here already. Already. And they've been open like 20 minutes so far. So yeah, let's go. Uh, let's go take a look around. It's gonna be easier just to pick a corner and start working my way around because there's a whole bunch of stuff to see in here. Ooh, some Lord of the Rings. Frodo. It's two towers. Got some loose TMNT. Let's see what we got. These don't. I don't know, is it me or is it really dark in here? Oh yeah. Is that complete? Let's see. Um, psycho man. <laughs> Lots of vintage stuff in this booth. Lots of cool stuff. Ooh, Twilight Ring Ray. Nice. Flaming Ring Ray. So this booth is really cool. It's a lot of like G.I. Joe military type stuff in here. I'm not very familiar with any of this, so I don't know the names and everything, but it's really cool. This looks like a booth that uh, Greg Cook would come to. In fact, I, I'm pretty sure, I bet he does. Got all kinds of stuff down there. There's a lot of stuff to see here, people. Lots of stuff to see. Let's see what we got over here. Dr. Octopus. Let's see what we got up here. Boba Fett's ship right up there. Nice. What is that, Captain? And y'all, I'm sorry, I'm just talking as I'm like, a lot of the stuff I'm gonna say probably won't sound like it makes sense, but um, it's because I'm talking out loud to myself. And y'all are just like along for the ride. <laughs> Nice. Oh, that Splinter and Baxter already got that one. Yo! Oh, there's Megatron. Starscream. Tapes. Nice. Okay, and here's... uh. Mythic Legions right here. There's Dub right there. Let's see which one he suggests that we uh, we start out with. Let's take a look at some of this stuff. I'm not even gonna like try to pronounce these names. Kragnar. That one looks pretty simple, but look at that. The detail, the paint job on these are freaking incredible. 2024 Retailer Appreciation Wave pre-order open now. Take a look at these. You can't really, there we go, that's a little better. Outpost Zaxius. Nice. 
honestly, like two years to find one because this is the hardest part. It's just the drills. Like you find them yeah. everywhere or even online, but you know that's missing or this is missing, and then like. I'm not a inbox collector or a grader, but to have a box is beautiful. And then to Dude, have I mean, yeah, that, that is that know, is freaking. Like, I can't beat it. That is beautiful. And I've been like, I'm not like one of those guys that's a completions either. Like, I just I like what I like, and I kind of go after. Yeah, them. yeah, yeah. So I got the metallic foot soldier. It was like one of the last vintage ones I really wanted. Yeah. Pull the trigger on that when our buddy wound up buying the collection. Have it. No, this. And this is one. This is one of the ones I did not have as a kid. This is the one I remember as a kid of like. I can't wait to have that again. I oh. can't. Like, I'm like, it's a good feeling. Like, <laughs> Literally, like you, I mean? I you can't even think of what to I say. Can't. I can't. It's, just, it's unbelievable to think I'm holding it right now. I like, know. Honestly, it's weird. And it's like, is it open? So the tape was open? Yep. Yeah, what? I'm not even mind. That's it. Just the tape was popped. Yeah. Hey, I go to him like, what's the deal? He's like, I really bought these in a collection yesterday. And I'm just, I brought them here to get rid of them. He's like, literally the tape just popped. Other than that, it's oh mint my and box. God. Still, I'm like, oh my God. I was like, uh, yeah, um, uh, no more thinking. Uh, what best you could do? He's like, well, I'm like, thank, thank you very much. Well, you can go home now. Yeah. I'm, done. I'm done. I am. I'm not lying. I'm done. Now just, just to hang out with you guys. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm so yeah. thrilled now. I love it. I get to record for a little bit more, and then I'm like, so like, look, it's yeah, funny. Look. You walked by as I was looking at the uh, the sewer playset. All my attention too. I was like, I can't believe that was like. I'm like, what in the heck is going on? Like, it's all turtle stuff. Right? Oh, and so, look, 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 the knucklehead right really above cool. it. It is. It's so. It's, it's like, you think you think they'll re-release the uh, playset? You know that would be so freaking awesome. You know, look up there, the technodrome. Right up there. Never had that as a kid. One of the few Ninja Turtle things I did not have as a kid. And then go in here, take a look. Yes, the pizza launcher. Turtles have Shredder pinned down and are rolling their pizza thrower into position. I'll blast you with retro mutagen. But before he can act, the pizza thrower's adjustable aim and motorized firing action give Shredder and his henchmen their just desserts. Pizza thrower, whatever. Ooh. Oh my god, y'all, I'm getting so distracted in here. That OG lion -O, Thundercats. My goodness. Look at all this. But yeah. Ninja Turtles. Oh, they even got the foot cruiser up there. What is this? Oh, I guess it's like the uh, instructions or something, or little inserts that came with the figures. So lots and lots of turtle stuff at David's booth. Oh, Space Cadet Raphael. 55. I love that figure. Love that figure right there. Let's see, who is this? Genghis Frog. Robot Rocksteady. We got Baxter Stockman. I'm not gonna worry about opening them up. Baxter. There's Splinter. And again, they're in the bag, so I'm not gonna like try to open them up. Foot Soldier, Raphael. But look right here, y'all. Krang. Might have to pick up Krang. So I've been wanting a Krang, man. Might have to come back and pick him up. Let's see, that's the that's Shredder, but I don't like the like glossy or the shiny looking Shredder. I don't care for that one. Let's see, Foot Soldier. Got the uh, looks like the Target Holothon Turtles, Turtles in Disguise, and then got this pack right here. The uh, premonition of a premutation. The human versions of Rocksteady, Bebop, Baxter, and Splinter. So that's cool. And we got Chrome Dome back here for 50. Nice. Man. So you got Metalhead. 
Chrome Dome again. Foot Soldier. Let's see. I'm trying to get back here because I believe that's um. Oh. Knocked over their drinks. <laughs> There's a dirt bag and ground chuck right there. For 60. Sorry, y'all. I know it's kind of dark down here. And we got the uh, Rasputin and Genghis, Splinter and Baxter. No. Wing nut and screw loose. We got the uh, Triceratons. Robot. Bebop and Rocksteady. A stuck and mutagen man. Trag and Granitor. 45. Not a bad price. Oh my goodness. Ah, here we go. Dirtbag and ground chuck. Man. Y'all, check out what I just found. Mighty Max Skull Dungeon. I had this as a kid. I had like five or... Uh, I had several of the Mighty Max. This was one of my favorite ones. 70 bucks or a hundred. I'm not sure which what the price is, but dude, that is so freaking cool. Nice. Let's see, what is this right here? Don't know. I'm just gonna keep looking. Oh, there's a Jubilee right there. I'm gonna have to go take a look at that. Look at the, I mean much cool stuff. Nice, 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 nice. You gotta watch it, bro. Don't, don't blame the cave. Don't blame the guy. Ooh, there's one of the Ninja Turtle trays over there. I'll take a look at that in just a second. I loved the Kenner Batman figures when we were kids. They were so awesome. And there was like a Batman for everything. There's something new in Gotham City. It's Batman! Like you've never seen him before. Figures and vehicles sold separately. Why she does, Batman. My tech shield suit protects me. Even against this sludge, your poison can't hurt my tech shield suit. But we had so, I don't even remember, like we had so many of them, I couldn't even tell you all the ones we had. But let me look over here. That turtle tray right there, looking good. Only know of two turtle trays that existed back then. And that's the other one. I don't think I've ever seen that in person. There's Galvatron. Look at those combiners right there. Nice. Oh, who didn't have California Raisins and Smurfs? Lots of cool stuff. Lots of cool stuff. Uh, Metalhead. Scratch. Isn't that, isn't that what he's called? Scratch? I think so. There you go. <laughs> Ken almost got his arm chopped off by the elevator. It's late night. It's almost 11 and we're gonna walk around to the different hotel rooms and see what everyone's got available i think we're gonna go to 810 first i don't know man we're just gonna go to a bunch of rooms oh look there's jb <laughs> were they saying earlier inception inception you're inside him he's inside you oh god oh god I think Ken said something about breaking those doors they're gonna do it oh yeah like look they got security posted up in front of the doors are you 
What's our yeah? Room? Let's see. Uh, Ron, did you take a picture? I did. What What's the first like, room? Three something. Five eleven is the vintage. Three hundred can't be good. I thought that was David's right. David's that's not the weight limit. All right, I know I had a burger, but that's not the weight limit. All right, we are now in room 810. Let's see what we got. Holy crap. Castle Grayskull. Dang it. They do got a setup in here. Castle Grayskull. $20. $20? $20? A white piece of paper slab. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, is that me, Rock Steady? Ah, s on me. Is that what? Turtle dicks. Turtle what? Turtle dicks. Turtle what? Turtle dicks. <laughs> Bebop and Rocksteady. This guy pointed out to me. This showroom comes in personality. How much is the Castle Grayskull? Oh, I don't know. Maybe, maybe. Oh my gosh. 70 bucks. Maybe. So let's see what else is in here. Look. Yeah. Mirage turtles right here. Look at that. Eight fifty. Okay. Okay. Ooh, Ghostbusters. What you got up here, buddy? What you buying? What you buying, big man? Look at this. What G one Transformers? Like, I was about to say, holy. Sh did you see in here? No, everyone's getting their camera. Did you see all this? Holy crap. This is a hotel room. This is what I'm talking about, y'all. Holy crap. Well, that's true. Wow. All the games. Any upsets or what's going on? Taking bets? <laughs> Look, oh man, yeah, Transformers out there, Metroplex, Trypticon, what is that, Scorpion? Wonder Woman cake pan. I've been looking for that cake pan for years. Yeah, got, she's got the Wonder Woman mask in there too. Oh, my <coughs> oh, oh, oh. Know what I'm doing oh, when I get God. back? Bacon and cake. <laughs> This is the extent while wearing the mask. <laughs> yeah, there, yes. <laughs> there you go. I gotta find the lasso now. Yeah, yeah. Oh, head to head. Oh, oh, here's some transformers right here. So check it out. It's got Metroplex. I broke my brother's Metroplex when I was little. Maybe I should get him one to replace it. Maybe, maybe, probably not. But you know. Oh yeah, we had uh, we had those two. Well, we had one of them that uh, I don't know what was it called, six shot or something like that. I think that we had. I know. <laughs> Got to get down. So Kent brought us into his room to show us his dioramas. Pretty cool, man. I love that stone. I love the texture and the color. I mean, look at that. That's awesome. And the bricks, once you start building, that's kind of how you go through the bricks. Is that? That's like a, it's like a throne right there. Yeah, that's really cool looking. Yeah. You ain't leaving tomorrow, or you're getting the Jake the Snake DDT. And you can no longer go. Magic City. 
Only Marine Room. Series <laughs> in the elevator again. That, that, that one he Going up to 619. That's for me. That's the first one for me. Even though like people like oh Shredder's clearly you like. Best ever. Yeah. So he's got. Um, can't take you serious. <laughs> 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 oh, oh. Uh, let's see. Legs were so, so his that legs are scale. made out of the Okiedo's arms, the skeleton arms. That yes, yes, because yes. I wanted like little scrawny legs. What is the that torso you have? Like, is that like just a gobble torso? Yeah, it's like a uh, elf one? ranger type. Uh, you know that one with oh, the. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So it's playing off. Yeah, yeah. He sound a lot like. Where it's at. Look at those. Um, this pack yeah, of man, uh, wired, um, wired goods. Got wire in the, um, mm. in the room. So that one was fun. It's filthy. Is he a mojo? So that's Cyclone. I tried to get a little, yeah, so I did a samurai oh, style yeah. Cyclone. Alternate head. I'm going to get low. <laughs> so, uh, Alternate, I, alternate head, alternate feet. Bunch of, <clears throat> That's as many parts as I've seen you pull. Yeah. Um, the stupid f flag broke uh, right mm. here. 50% off. 50% off. <laughs> the entire purchase. Repeat buyer discount. Um, Merman was fun. Uh, mm. He doesn't have... A, to, oh, so the uh, the little barnacles were sculpted on there, mm -hmm. um, like green stuff. Uh, yeah, mixed between uh, green stuff and um, uh, uh, epoxy. Epoxy is the same shit, basically, but a little different consistency. So this one, the feet were sculpted for him. Uh, I couldn't find elephant feet anywhere, so I had to do this. And then the tail, I did a custom elephant tail on him. Oh, so no. You can't find a wired Just. elephant tail, so it's got like little. Uh, you want the elephant? Little, you want uh, elephant? Tree. We call that thread. Yeah, I love wired that elephant, man. Tail. The elephant is nasty. Um, I mean, I, 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 the, I keep trying, almost buying the, the Masterverse. Snout spout, which looks great, but it's not that because I know I, I opened it up. No, Did you? No, no, no. I, don't I opened mine up just the other day. It's not that. It is like <clears throat> complete end of the spectrum. He's got it right in here somewhere. It's yeah, good. But yeah, it's that's what that. he's got. When we were yeah. growing up, they paid pretty good. They um for what it was. Party. They did. They got robbed, but they wanted. It. They wanted. It. They were like, hey, you want to come here and work? I told my mom, like, no, you're not going down there. Like, right. How old are you? I'll be forty-eight. You probably work for the same Trevs and Trevs that like that with the franchise thing. I, I got because my manager actually she is crazy because my old manager is now. Yeah, this is Saturday, y'all. Packed, 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 packed. Very loud in here. Lots of commotion. Lots of talking. Lots of negotiations being made. Pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. Second Chance Toys, Vintage Toys and Collectibles. They're like an hour and a half, maybe hour or something from from here. So let's, let's see what they got in here. I think I looked a little bit at this one yesterday, but I can't remember. But there's a Technodrome up there, Snake Mountain, Green Ranger helmet. I think that's the Hasbro one, maybe. I don't know. Lots of vintage turtle stuff. Let's take a look in here. Voltron. Nice. It has been a long, long time since I've seen Voltron toys. In fact, I don't even, I don't think we had any of the, uh, 
the figures as kids. I think we just had like the robot Voltron. Check out this tank right here. Sherman tank. $989. Please be careful. Okay, I just wanted to see what it was made of. Yeah, this booth has a bunch of, um, I want to say like military style stuff. I don't want to explain things the wrong way about stuff I'm not familiar with, but lots of pretty cool stuff. You're good. Nice. All right, so we are over here at the Toy Federation booth, which is really big, and they have a lot of cool stuff, so let's take a look. This whole, I believe this whole rack right here is Transformers. Um, we got some Revenge of the Fallen stuff right here. Let's see. Sunstreaker. Optimus Prime. Which one is this? Mech Tech. A lot of these I've never seen before. Of course, I, was, I wasn't really collecting or anything when these movies came out, so like the uh, Dark of the Moon, Revenge of the Fallen and stuff. Let's see, come over here, Skull Grin. Rodimus. Let's see, what does he look like? Yeah. Flip for robot mode. Oh, I thought. <laughs> I don't know why I thought like you just flip the toy and it'll become the robot mode. I don't know why I thought that, but whatever. There's Gnaw, grabbed him recently in that two pack. Nine to five warriors. <laughs> We've got some stuff up there too. Yeah, it is really, it's really dark in here. Marvel Legends, there's a Marvel Legends Deadpool right there. And turn over here. We got Colossus and Juggernaut. Nice for 120. I really like that Colossus. I mean, I like the Juggernaut too, but I like the Colossus a little more. I really like this two pack as well. Wolverine and Hulk from Wolverine's first appearance. What was it? Incredible Hulk 180 or 181? Does it say it on the back? Yeah, 181. I think he actually, I think he made a brief appearance at like the end of 180. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I know he was fully in 181. His first ever appearance <clears throat> in that costume where he has the whiskers. We got Thanos and Iron Man. The Hellfire Club. Who is in this? Sebastian Shaw. Looks like Emma Frost. Looks like Madeline Pryor. Then up here. We got the uh, the turtle layer right there. Turtle van, the NECA turtle van, turtle layer. 
that that Wolverine and Sabretooth 2 pack that I will be getting really soon. Because I think they uh, they updated the shipping date. Ooh, got Galactus too. That is a huge box, man. Huge box. There's the uh, Mirage 4 pack up there. Lots of good stuff. <clears throat> and then we got Superion right here, 300 bucks. Transformers! Some mask, go bots. Got some turtles down here, which I'm always happy to see. I think that's is that the soft head? Look at that. That is so. I love it when they still have the original price tags on them. So I think that says $4.99 at KB Toys. Love KB Toys. Oh, <clears throat> the new Biker Mice for Mars from Nacelle. We got Moto. Throttle. These look really good. And Vinny. Anyone else watch that cartoon? Back in the day, it was a really good cartoon. Oh, there's War Duke. There was a guy dressed as War Duke uh, yesterday. Oh, the TMNT accessory set. 80 bucks. As all that stuff has little baby turtles, the TV, and just all kinds of stuff. Gonna have to, oh, gonna have to remember that's there. Cause I missed out on that. Look up here, we got the dark turtle back there, which is awesome. Let's see, and Scrag. Hundred bucks each. And then we got the uh, Fox Daddy and Bebop dressed as the uh, Easter Bunny. Lots of good stuff. It's going to be the blue frame. Uh, Miles Morales. Okay. There's Loki. The new Storms, Tigra. Oh, and there's some rhinos up there. How much are those? Can't really tell. I think it says $59.99. And that is a huge figure and a huge card as well. So we got a Ghostbusters, two of the sets right here, two hundred dollars for the both of them, both uh, sets or one hundred and twenty each. Those are really nice. Let's see what we got in here: Iceman, Secret Wars. Oh, there's Spider-Man Secret Wars. Nice. So Galvatron. Sludge. And some Pops. Oh. Sorry, y'all. I know I'm not like talking a whole lot. I'm just kind of taking it all in. Let's 
I don't know. Maybe some of y'all prefer that. <laughs> What are these? Mirage. I saw some of these, um, I think it was the other day at uh, in Alabaster at Target or, or something like that. Dinobot Sludge. It'd be cool if they had a Rumble, but I don't think they do. I looked at these earlier. Got some of the, uh, the NECA Team and T figures right there. Some loose figures. Let's see. I think they had some loose uh, turtles. Not really sure. I'd have to take a look. What is this? Is this Galvatron? Kind of looks like a Galvatron. Phoenix. Oh, I was like, the video was so blurry. It's because it's so dark in here. So if you see something in this oh, yeah. Here we go. Well, then you must love our yeah, Savage Crucible. Very much so, I got one of right up there. Oh, well, yeah, yeah. I mean, like, he was there because he was just cool guy show up, right? But, but one day, she said, why it's like, and uh, one day, he was just, like, Please do not touch. Again, pay attention to signs. Yeah, yeah I did it too. <laughs> it's really cool. <laughs> yeah, but at the same point in time, it was like... <laughs> Check it out. <sighs> Micro Machines. Millennium Falcon, Star Destroyer, and an X-Wing. Cool. Top spin. Some turtles over there. And look at that right here. That's cool. Disney afternoon. Got tailspin, gummy bears, Chippendale, and DuckTales. Oh, I didn't even see the karate kid. of the kingdom he just gave me a hammer which is really cool get this thing to focus there we go let's take a look and see what we got over here Ooh, that one's kind of cool what does that say Tiberius some on display over here. I'll take a look at those here in a second. Excuse me. 
Got some more on display over here, and I really like how these companies have the accessory sets available for purchase separately. Weapons and different things, and it's just really cool. Okay, so let's look at some Marvel stuff. Who remembers the Tiger Electronics handheld games? Those are so cool. And there's a Gambit. I picked up the uh, retro carded Gambit at uh, Atlanta Comic Con. Let's see what we got up here. We got Sabretooth. Oh, there's another Doctor Doom. There's Deadpool. Nice. Weren't these, uh, these were at movie theaters, weren't they? Oh, wait, no. Taco Bell and... It's crazy. I remember when these came out. It feels, it, it feels like it wasn't that long ago, but it was, it was a pretty long time ago. There might be some people watching this video that weren't even born yet, which is crazy to me. Oh, check that out. The, uh, it's like a dress up or it's a costume, but I had the Blue Ranger one. Again, if I remember to post it, I'll throw up a photo right here of me wearing it uh, when I got it for Christmas. But yeah, that's cool. I liked how everything, a lot of the stuff from the Power Rangers back then came in like those triangular shaped boxes. I thought that was really cool and interesting. Lots of Simpsons stuff. Oh, check it out, check it out. A bunch of Disney stuff. Darkwing Duck. Check it out, y'all. That's the TMNT tray that I had as a kid. Oh, look at it. It's beautiful. I like that one a lot more than the uh, the other orange one that came out. But let me let me just start over here. Ooh, got some mad balls. That's cool. GoBots lunchbox. Fat Albert lunchbox. Hey, hey, hey. Ooh, Star Wars lunchbox. I'm not sure if that's a vintage one, but still pretty cool looking. It's coming here. Ooh, Street Sharks. And they just started uh, coming out with uh, the like reissues of them too. Well, I guess that is maybe a vintage one. It's signed by Chewbacca, Darth Vader, Admiral something. Oh, and look at that lion head right there. Foot cruiser. Oh. All right, look at that. That one's in much, much better condition than mine. Looks really faded, though. I think mine's darker. Like, the colors are still dark, but... Ah, that's still cool, though. That's still cool. Dexter's Laboratory. <laughs> I 
So this is the booth that Century was talking about. These are some of the figures that he was uh, talking about looking at. Still over here. Complete. Yeah, complete. 250. I think he's. Uh, I think he said he's going to come over here and grab it. I think. Don't quote me on that. Oh. Nice. Oh, come on. There we go. Lots and lots of loose turtles. There's a crane. I had the big one as a kid. I never had the little one. Look at that. Surfing Mike. Mikey. And there's Brown Chuck. Oh, look at this. And here's that Krang in package. Super Shredder. Ooh. Rocksteady. Shredder, Michelangelo. It's like a metallic foot soldier. Splinter. Oh man. Let's see what's back here. Oh my gosh, there's Bebop right there. And I was just talking about how I'd rather have the vintage Bebop and Rocksteady because they just look so much better than the uh, ones that came out. But I don't mind having it loose though. Like, I don't need it in the package or anything. So, maybe I'll be able to come across some loose ones that are complete while I'm here. Let's look over there. See, we got dirt bag. Scumbug. Yeah, I'm gonna have to try my best to brighten this up in the post, but Ooh, I think that's the trans yeah, that's the transport mutating, excuse me, mutating Donatello. Mutagen man. Lots and lots of loose turtles. Oh yeah, here's the this is the crane that I had when I was younger. <laughs> I picked up the uh, the NECA version yesterday. It's really cool. Oh, and then we got the turtle van. Lots of cool stuff in this booth. Captain Planet. <laughs> Check those out right there. I forgot what they're called. Um, like their actual name. I know the one to the right was like, um, was that Grandizer right there? Uh, we used to love watching that as kids, but, but yeah, there was a whole bunch of them actually. I didn't realize that until we were older. And I like, I, I see the name in my head, but I don't want to like screw it up and be embarrassed. So, uh, yeah. Over here, five dollars each. Oh yeah, we had. I think I had the uh, Red Ranger of this. Okay. 
know, that's the idea. Yeah. Where it, it's not easy. Right. Yeah, yeah. Got some loose stuff down here. We do got some, got some turtles in here. Metal head. Love the metal head figure as a kid. I saw that earlier today. Alright, let's take a look at some of this uh, Marvel stuff in this booth. There's a whole bunch of Marvel stuff. Lots of Spider Man stuff, too. Carnage. Got a Venom right here. That Venom is nice. Very nice. Lots of vintage. Lots of vintage. Oh, vintage Wolverine. Human Torch, Alistair, was it Smythe? Right? Why, wait, why does it say Carnage? All right, so I'm not sure if I really, like, had a chance to really look at the uh, Legions yesterday, but here's Cosmic Legions. That one looks great. Check this dude out right here. That is so cool. And I was just told this one right here, like the creator drew it in like seventh grade or something. And it was in his notebook. And that's it right there. Like, I'm sorry the quality isn't that great because I'm zooming in, but it looks really, really awesome. So, uh, let's see, where is it? Is it up here? I really like this one right here too. I like the blue and the orange together. And then we got the, uh, the Mythic Legions, the newer ones, the new wave. Over here, got that wizard. Like, I was thinking about this guy yesterday, but I don't know. Like, I'm, I don't know. I might be leaning towards this one today. Not really sure yet. Still deciding, still deciding. I think JB said he picked that one up, the genie. That one looks really cool. Man, that's awesome. We got the, the horses over here. You just put out what? I got him. Oh, oh. Before, but he just put out the shirt. Oh, okay. He's right here. That one looks so badass. Headless horseman. So y'all, I came across this yesterday, but check this out. I'm not sure if I recorded this, so if I didn't, I'm sorry. But Galactic Man, the Radio Shack version of Shockwave for 350. Turn this around. Like, I like how it says it's four figures, but really it's just the, the robot version with three different... Like, oh, look, I tilted the, the legs up, and now it's a different 
version. But yeah, that was really cool to see. Because I had heard about this one for a while. I've never seen it in person. Yeah. I remember that. Oh, speaking of which, look who joins us today. Hey. <laughs> He's back. I'm back. Back for more. Yeah. So I think we may have found like the Marvel Legends mecca over here. <clears throat> Let's see what we got. Uh, I do like this mystique. Sixty bucks. My Walgreens still has a whole bunch of those. Marvel Select Captain America. Mm -hmm. Infamous Iron Man. Let's see. Like that Cyclops. I just got the uh, X Men 97 Cyclops, though, so I don't feel like I need another Cyclops right now and I really I know the beast that I have is pretty much the same version but man he that blue is beautiful let's see who else is back here is that Forge let's see Colossus oh there's another Cyclops Ooh, I like that cable I like that version of Cable. I like that version of Cable more than I do the one that just came out. Black Bolt. I like that vision right there. Let's see. Oh. That's the uh, version of Wolverine that I was wanting to get before I got the X-Men 97 version. So, that's really cool to see too. I like the claws more on this one than I do the uh, X-Men 97 one, though. There's the X-Force Wolverine. Oh, there's Nightcrawler. really like that one and he comes with his sword as opposed to the newer one the X-Men 97 one where he does not man yeah, just Marvel Legends everywhere everywhere There's a blade. Carnage. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I'm gonna like dig through all of them, but and there's the spider ham back there. Oh, I do like this Wolverine right here, though. Oh, wait, wait, wait. That's not the one that I'm thinking of. I was thinking of, like, the actual brown suit Wolverine, not this, um, this newer, the newer one. Oh, I'd love to have this Green Goblin, but not for 70 bucks. Yes, There's Electro, that one's cool too. Hobgoblin. Spider-Man 2099. So we got Spider-Man 2099 for 45 bucks. That is a really nice figure. Uh, 
Hey, I, I There's still more over there. You know, I gotta spread it in. Let's put the love a little. Ooh, and I like this door. Uh, let's just cash out. And there's the new uh, hatch, and Joe Fix It figures it came out. Uh, and the, uh, the saber tooth. Wolverine. So this is one that we had as kids. I cannot remember. Do you remember? Do you remember what the name of him is? I don't remember the name of him, but we had this one as kids, and we I played with this one so much. And he has his accessories right there. It was a really fun transformer. I don't remember the name though. You got a. Power Rangers TV tray up there. Really cool. More Tiger Force. Dinosaurs motorized kit. Oh. Lots of GI Joe stuff. See, I told you I'd find a vintage Bebop, 25, and it's complete. Even has his little card in there. Hmm. Hmm. So we got some other vintage turtles up in here, too. There's a tribe. Some mum rum. Uh, um, I think the issue I had with this one. It's like road hauler because like in the cartoon he's yellow isn't mm -hmm. he well it's because he looks a lot like the who would be on the devastator oh yeah yeah you, you look like um, <clears throat> Hall, yeah i don't know because I, th I think i could be wrong i think in the cartoon he was more yellow than green because he was in the g1 cartoon he's he's not, he's not yeah he's hmm. I think he was. Maybe like a yellowish green. I don't know. I just didn't like the color, so that's why I never picked him up. I didn't feel like it matched very well. Darwin. Sabretooth. Legion. There's Legion in there. Yeah. What's this? Cup. Turtles. Let's see what we got here. There's Donnie in disguise. I love calling him Detective Donnie because that's what he looks like. But yeah, there's the Bebop, and he had a Rock Steady too. Where to go? Rock Steady right here for twenty. Here's another booth I did not get a chance to see yesterday. Maybe I did. I don't know. Yesterday was kind of a blur, so there's <laughs> a lot of stuff going on. I think I did maybe take a look at this stuff. Dirt bag, Triceraton. I can't wait till they do the reissues of these. 
But that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to wait for the reissues. And, you know, I love the uh, the originals, but I don't know. I feel like the reissues are fine as long as the, uh, the paint is good and, like, it pretty much looks like they did when they came out originally. Because that Bebop and Rocksteady, the reissues look terrible. I like that Muck Man. I mean, that is a beautiful, beautiful figure right there. Another booth that has plenty of vintage turtle goodness. Look at all these slashes right here. Wait, wait I already got that one, I think. Technodrome. I think eBay. I mean, no, not eBay. Instagram. It's one of those random things that come up with the yeah. Sewer tube. I think I had this. I think I had that. I got a. I really can't remember. Check out the View Masters. Classic, classic, classic. Woo. Nice. Lots of loose stuff down here. Looks like a bunch of marble. Got the Mezco turtles up there. 575. Got the uh, OG Megazord. Had that as a kid. There's Ultra Magnus right there. There's Jetfire. Ghostbusters Zapper Proton thing. You got Megatron right here, complete in box. Star Spoon. Good. Yeah, Tracks. There's Jetfire Loose. There's Optimus Prime. And there's a whole Computron complete for 150. I think this is um I think that's what Travis was looking for, but I don't think he wants the whole Computron, just the uh I could be mistaken, I'm not sure if that's six shot or not. I think it is. Let's see, what is this? Leonardo. This has the creature from the Black Lagoon. Yeah. Four twenty-five. Here. here we go. It's better view right here. Raphael, mutant Raphael. Yeah, I know. Lots of D&D. &D. Ah, here's Omega Supreme. Look what we have here, the Farmer Mike and his turtle tractor in box. Two twenty. I've never seen this one in person, nor did I ever see it as a kid. So that's pretty cool to see. There you go, lots of Star Wars Black Series. Darth Revan. Get it to focus, there we go. Let's 
see who else do we got in here. Got Ahsoka. I like that version of her. Uh, yeah, there's Yoda right back there. I have him though. Darth Vader. Oh, here we go. On solo. There's a loop. They used to make these faces to put the guys in. $20.99 up there, $5.50. So look, we got a vintage sound wave. We got a vintage sound wave, y'all. Complete. Takara. He said it is, his price is 140 on it. Got Metroplex. Complete. Oh, Centurions. Do you remember Centurions? No, I don't remember them. You probably would if you saw the intro to the cartoon. Probably. Uh, let's see, who else do we got down here? Got Star Screen. Who is this? Inferno. Oh, nice. Huh? Ah, uh, uh, I can't remember. That isn't, wait, that isn't like a knockoff thing, is it? No. I do, man, I wish I could remember. Does anyone know what his name is? Let me know in the comments, even though by the time you comment, I might have already figured it out, but do it anyway. What did he say? Excuse me. There's a jet fire complete. Oh, from a Freddy King? Yep. Freddy King. I'm not sure what his name was specifically. Maybe it's on there, but. Tantrum. Tantrum. There's Tantrum right there. It goes to Freddy King. There's a Mirage. You see Devastator over here? There's a vintage sludge. Yeah. When we first got him, I thought that was his original color. It was yellow. And when I saw green, I was like, that's green. Yeah. Oh, and there's a slag back there, too. Animal Kingdom dudes, whatever they're called. Yeah. They got some the box, I'm assuming. I'm not sure if that's the box for the one over here, but. Lots of vintage. This is this Migo stuff. Lots of cool stuff. Lots of cool vintage uh, Transformers over there. Complete, too. Oh. You got a Cosmos over here, too. Cosmos. Yep.
and people can do something that they've wanted to do for a long time, finally. And they will also make another character that uh, may not be as prominent in this wave and just try to make as much sense of it and bring as much value. Yeah, here's some Marvel Legends I missed uh, earlier today and yesterday. Got this Iron Man right here for 20. I do like that one. So you got Chasm right there. Oh, there's the Captain America. I really like this Captain America. The only thing I don't like is the stuff on the shield and I know you can take it off but it leaves those holes on the shield that I I don't like I wish it didn't leave the holes on the shield but otherwise I really like this Captain America let's see and we got Silver Surfer I like that it's like a gunmetal color right there Got this Mystique. I've seen this Mystique everywhere. I don't know if she's like trying to convince me to pick her up. So I really like that. I really like that Mystique. Let's see who else is in here. Eh, not too much else I want to see. Oh, it's a Jean Grey. Got some vintage lunch boxes. I'm pretty sure my brother had that one. I know he had a Mario one, but I'm pretty sure it was this one. There's another Mario one right there. Oh, when Mario shared uh, a show with Legends of Zelda. Sam Barbie. G.I. Joe, ALF, Micro Machines, a bunch of little golden books, Garfield and the Space Cat. Oh, check out that tray, X-Men tray. It's really cool. I've never seen that one before. And they got a G.I. Joe one. Mickey Mouse, Mickey Mouse, Annie, and another Mickey Mouse. Cool. Some more Mighty Max. I don't think I had either of these though. I didn't have either of these. And there's some of the miniature ones right here. And some old McDonald's toys right here. I loved these as a kid. I'm not sure if I showed this yesterday, but uh four thousand dollar sealed technodrome looks pretty good um i don't have four thousand dollars to to blow on it but um you know still pretty cool to see uh, and here's some here's some mythics right here some of the ones they have i think they have a few of these in there at the mythics table there's a foot soldier, one of the re-releases. Yeah. What is that? Delta Donatello. Good to come. Got some vintage turtles. Oh, excuse me, I had a burp just then. Got some vintage turtles. Oh, there we go. That's why I like to see the original price. 
$3.99 for old Baxter Stockman. And let's see, like, the reissue, most of them don't have the painted teeth. Like, the teeth are uh, the, the same blue color as the face. And I don't like that. I'd rather have the one where the teeth are painted. Oh, you know what? Ah, some Megazords up there. Ooh, and the Falcon Zord. Yeah, I had that. Oh, some Swamp Thing figures. I'm pretty sure we had this. Bio Jack. Yeah, because I remember this. I remember using it just to squirt water all the time. Oh, yep. I had that Swamp Thing. That's the one where, like, all, like, yeah, like his limbs come apart. And you press the button on the back and they all zip back to him. Oh, and I had that one too. I think he changes color, like, in the water or something. Ah, hold on, they're all falling off. And then, yes, I love that one too. I think this one was probably my favorite one, like, his hand comes out. Yes. Man, these are cool to see. We had like all of these. Those are also cool to see. So we're here at Marlowe's Tavern. Gonna have some some dinner. We're looking at that panini. And then you're giving me shit out of eleven o'clock tomorrow. What you looking at, Dave? I have no idea. I'm still trying to figure out. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff on this menu. Travis, what you get? And what do they call it? They call it uh, the Royale with cheese. Royale with cheese. That's right. <laughs> do you know what they call a Royale with cheese? It's got black and cheese. Seared perfectly and stacked. American cheese does it. Wait, 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 wait. Have you ever seen Pulp Fiction? Once. No. That's why we were laughing. That's why you were laughing. That's why I completely missed it. Royale with cheese. <laughs> you know what they call a Royale with cheese? <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, that's that's hilarious. I mean, does it look like JB complains like about food? Huh? What are you ordering? Well, he's like, it's a tavern, bro. Tavern? Bar food, man. It is. That, that is also here we got Ken Poe, we got Seth, we got Damien. Little did he know that he was incorrect. His name was not Damien after all. His name was Jan. Hey, Drew. How many times do you need to Over there. Got Five times today. David. Ron. Five times a day. Hey, I'm mad. I'm so steak. I don't feel like it. We're hungry. Well, it's time to eat. Look at that very veggie burger. I used to be vegetarian. Yeah, that's an intense. I'm saying right now. An intense battle is ensuing right now. Let's go. 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 <laughs> He's going back. Nah. That's how you watch it. If you would like a set, get your Trevor and have free get you a set. One hundred bucks. Hit him. Hit him with. Hit him with a pre bit. Hit him with a pre bit. Do it. Do it. We got 100. 120. Come on, Dave. 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 Come on, 125, 125, 125, Oh, 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 o
Please put your pants on. We're about to go on some room tours again. Hopefully you have your <laughs> pants on. <laughs> yeah. Seth, he means you. What? Make sure you have your pants on this time. The people in the room. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't me. Yeah. Like, what's going on under those covers there? 300 was the first I one been nominated for Door Doctor. And yeah. Excuse me, extra figures? Yes. Extra figures? No, no, no. Extra figures. <laughs> I knocked last night and I ran. I don't know what you're talking about. They got a bite size. They got a, they got a bite size. They got two. They actually have a doorbell. They have a doorbell. So they, I mean, you can hit the doorbell on that. They have a doorbell? They have a doorbell. Seriously? Yeah. We got fancy action. This is. Mm -hmm. I guess we're going to somewhere <laughs> else. Three twenty-five. No Excuse one. me, action figures. All right, so hold on. So the next Excuse one. Excuse me, action figures. The next room was three twenty-five. Three twenty-five. Three twenty-five. Put like a comic effect of smoke flying out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those action figures. Ooh. Action figures. Oh. Action figures. Oh. Action figures. Oh. It's open. Oh, oh it's dark in here. Come in. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 Look, I had to like peek around the corner a little bit. Content. Give us a little shake. Oh, baby. No. Got the oh, so there's there's Kent. Kenny naked. Yeah. Kent, oh, <laughs> he said, "Yeah." Housekeeping. Five eleven is the half price of vintage. Everything. Oh wait, that one at the end? Yeah, that's the one that had half. Nice. Price. I don't know that everything's half price. Right that's where we were. Right now. Hey, there's my room. Jimmy's toy truck right here. My room. Is it half price in there? It's got the do not disturb. Are you trying to get on punishment? Why'd you be mad at us? That's punishment. She definitely won. No. Travis spotted six shot before we even like really walked in. He just he, he just looked at me. He's like, they got six shot. Eighty bucks. That box. That box is Fifty percent. Wait, this is. Uh, he said what? I think he said that. Fifty percent off. I think he said the incomplete ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See. For the clarification. Is it? But well, it is complete though, right? Well, see, look, there you go. You see, like, you wouldn't even need yours anymore. You just take that one. Seriously. 80 bucks. A complete one. There you go. Oh, look, there's Hot Rod. Oh, I think this is where I saw that loose, uh... Oh, they're not in here anymore. Those loose, uh, Metroplexes. What? That's exactly makes it easy for me. There we go. This is a... He's the supervising. This would be counterproductive. This, this <laughs> looks way um, simpler than the. This is a how-to video about how to pack oh, yeah. your yeah. Yeah. product. Put him in a car. Go see a baby. Can't kick him. David, look. He's even look. He's even got a tape gun thing. My jig. Last year was <laughs> absurd. That was the whole thing. Nothing short. Specifically trying to protect the empty box. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which the the bed was. Yeah. Oh, we're talking about that. Yeah. Nothing sitting on. Who wants a shot? No one. The IPA. Thanks for watching. I've got. I'm just walking around with a ball bag. Yeah. I mean, um, this bartender Jason. This step bar. That sounds amazing. And now we leave you with sage advice from Big Dub. Do what now? Oh, okay. Why isn't anybody recording this? I am. Take oh, okay. the bait beads. <laughs> the bait beads. Yeah. Can be bushes. Can be corporate random. Spread them. Spread them. Across the thing. Fold them in half. Right? So you've got baked beans. You've got the... Th yeah, the right. Polarized. Fold them in half. Hang it from the shower. What in the... Of your roommate. <laughs> you know, wherever you're at, convention, football camp, building block. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Learn their allergy, gluten, <laughs> lactose, whatever. You know. Take them, treat them, 
to a delicious supplement <laughs> containing said what? allergy. What? Go in the shower. With them? No, you go in the shower <laughs> and get back where you have put the apparatus. Oh Before you do anything, turn the water off by the toilet. Wait, what was that hand motion again? Turn it. Okay. So then you go. You're bad. Meanwhile, the shower that still has water because you're in a place like a hotel where it's not, they're not connected. You act like you're going to take a shower. Wait for the mood to hit them. Wait. And you be like, oh, come on in. I, you know, I, I, I'll take my shower later. They go to poop and can't flush. They get a little concerned. So maybe they experiment with the shower. And then it's baked beans on the nose. Thank you. Okay. Thought about that before? Hey. Excuse me, action figures? Hey, action figures. All right, everyone, we are back from Toylanta. What? a show man it was so much fun going there lots of cool stuff to see met a lot of people hung out with a lot of people had a lot of fun i do plan on going back next year and probably every year after that so let's move on to the haul portion of the video i'll go ahead and get started so i pretty much picked up nothing but NECA tmnt while i was there and first up is mondo gecko and most of these have been out for a while i just didn't have them so you know i'm sure you have seen all of these before but mondo gecko first i did pick up that bebop and rocksteady that was in room 810 i believe so yep picked up bebop and rocksteady been looking for them for a while so glad to add them to the collection also picked up this triceraton two pack uh, which i've been eyeing for a while so glad to pick that one up too also picked up this really awesome dirt bag and ground chuck two pack and I was really excited to pick up the NECA Krang right there. And let me just say, besides the Bebop and Rocksteady, I picked up everything from David's booth. So thanks to David for being uh, really cool and giving me such a great deal. And last but not least, I picked up this print right here from Retro Toy Quest. Super, super awesome print. He has a ton of other prints with different action figure lines. You should go check them out. I'll put a link to his site uh, in the description. And lastly, these came in while I was at Toylanta. So came home to this four pack right here of the uh, reissue, the um, 80, 87. It says 87, but I think these came out in 88 actually. But anyway, it's the reissue turtles right there. And I'm Ah, man, I'm so glad to have these right here. And I can finally, I've been wanting to pick up the retro uh, party wagon, but I haven't because I didn't have the turtles to go in there. So now I can finally pick up the party wagon. But, um, but yep, that's all I picked up this weekend. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. I certainly enjoyed filming and uh, just everything about this weekend. Everything about the weekend was really awesome. So till next time, we'll see you later.